Hey, Team Christian Danielle fans, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Christian Danielle, back at you with another video. And as you can tell by the title, I'm going to talk about my summer so far. I mean, earlier this summer, you know, I was working on remaining sober because I had did something earlier this spring that got me sent to the hospital and I've been doing some kind of rehab and it helped me learn how to deal with life like bad breakups or whatever and then I ended up sw switching from weed to cigarettes yeah I used to smoke weed as well but my main problem was mostly alcohol and I really just wanted to be sober from alcohol. And when I found out I was going to be sober from both alcohol and weed, I was highly sad about it, but it is what it is. But here's how my summer been has Here's how my summer been so far. So far, I've been working working on my vlogs as well and I'm vlogging outside put the cig out because that was the end of the cig I've been working really hard to clean my image because if I really want to gain more subscribers and vlog for money, the goal is to get a thousand subscribers so that I can make the money in order for me to get out of my parents' house permanently and financially support myself. Because even with me being on SSI, my parents still believe I'm not going to be responsible for the money I have in that SSI account and in the last video which got deleted my fiance got upset with me for telling all our business and I understand that I shouldn't be telling all my business to people on social medias And I've done it in the past. You're gonna have to excuse this eye, this eye, one eyelash. It won't fucking stay. Like shit. I'm like, cause this is the eyelash I worn over the weekend. Like this past Friday night, I went out with my girl Maya. And I've been going out with my friends almost every day this past weekend. But now it's just me. So my son has been pretty good. I got to go to Washington, D.C. with my mother. That was awesome. I would have vlogged while I was in D.C., but my mom didn't want to participate in the vlogs. And I can totally understand that. Just like I said in a previous video, when I was doing the Starbucks move on, I was like, I know my dad wasn't going to want to participate in the video. Because pretty much he's private, my mom's private, my brother's private. I'm the only one that would want to do stuff like this, like vlog and speak out what's on my mind to the world. And regardless if I look a mess or not. <laughs> but. <sighs> shoot. But yeah, my summer is going really great.
and I love it. I'm having a great summer. The summer's not over yet, but it, but it's over for my students over at the daycare because we're going to be back in school as of August 2nd. And I spoke about wanting to vlog for money full time. And if I do get to vlog for money full time, I have thought about quitting my job because of it. But if my mom ever sees this video and I talked about quitting, she's probably going to be like, no, you're not doing it. You're going to stick to stick to this job, quit vlogging. Well, she won't mind me vlogging. But she's still going to want me to work. As as long as I'm not making an ass of myself. But I outgrown at making an ass of myself mess. I've really outgrown it. Because I'm not the same little girl that everybody still sees me as. And if you think that, y'all got me messed up. Because I can curse. I could just do anything normal adults do. It's like, just because I have a disability, that means I got to be silent or whatever the case it is. I'm still going to vlog. And vlogging and being in front of the camera is what I do best. Other than teaching. But that's my video. It's about seven to eight minutes long. I am out of here.